yeah hi friends in this video i would like to show you on how to create a how to run the depreciation yeah so so far we learned on how to post acquisition to multiple assets or single assets and then now i'm going to run the depreciation and um, show you the depreciation postings how the system is executing the depreciation so to run the depreciation um, you need to go to the financial accounting fixed assets periodic processing and depreciation run and then execute so here I'm going to execute for February so which is by the following month because I the assets are already posted so when I execute then the system is showing here so the depreciation is completed for the different depreciation areas so when we are posting the depreciation the system is trying to post to all the depreciation areas so in the test run you can run the system will show but in the case of a real run you need to uncheck this box and must execute in background so what I'm going to show you here so what details you should check so usually sometimes you will get errors so let's say um, when you go here so this is a PNL account so you need to make sure this PNL account the cost center should not be suppressed when you go to the GL account master data so which is uh, here so when you check on this is either it should be a cost account or you can see this account when you double click on it you can see the cost center so the cost center should be optional entry and if you have any order I would recommend to keep the order also optional and business area is also optional so these things you need to make sure and this is one and regarding the other things like the balance sheet account so this balance sheet account and everything account determination must be correctly mapped so when you go to the account determination here you need to make sure under the account assignment types here so you should maintain if you have a different depreciation area so let's say I have the depreciation area so 01 yes you need to maintain the cost center which is a APC value posting which will do statistical and uh, the transaction type you should enter star and uh, yeah this should be maintained so normal errors you will get if you forgot to maintain this information then usually you will get this kind of errors so regarding this also same if you are posting in the system so apart from this the account determination so you need to maintain here under the account determination assign GL accounts and my furniture and fixers because this is a furniture and fixer asset class so when you go is account determination is 30,000 so here I am going to the same account determination uh, to check uh, sorry so to check uh, the depreciation so don't go to the balance sheet so you need because you are running AFAB so you need to check the depreciation so if all these areas are needed for posting so these two accounts one is this is a balance sheet so when you say and um, this account actually um, um, one is a balance sheet and another one is this is a P&L accounts so you need to make sure these accounts maintained in the depreciation area you want to run the depreciation so um, this is a, a pre-check um, must be done uh, in the account determination so the table to to check this information is a t095 d sorry 95 b so the table you can directly check the account determination if anything missing so now i'm going to run in the background so hope it run without any fail 
So execute background run immediate post. So now I will go to my jobs. So click on own jobs. So after you click on own jobs, the system will open a new screen. Yes, here. So you can see the own jobs. So I will put here, which is only today's day. So you can see. Um, yeah, so maybe I should go SM37. Maybe it's good to see my job here, which is a So there's no spool usually there will be a spool yes sorry so our execution is actually done RAPOST select spool so five pages click OK yeah so you can see the system is posted for all the depreciation areas you can see the posting. So now when you go to the GL account so go to BLTN so execute so yeah, but um, I just mapped only one account for all the depreciation areas. So it is showing under the uh, same GL account. So usually in the normal business practice, you are not going to do that. So I don't want to make this so complicated. I'm just uh, going with the IFRS. But um, um, due to some uh, technical reason, I'm just posted to the same account. But in real business scenario, you will not be posting so many lines to the same TL okay because there will be only one area must be mapped with, with a one GL account so for the reporting purpose so also you will not post to the same cost center so there may be a cost center or may not be a cost center so there was always only one cost center will be for your allocations will be used in the in this case yeah so let's see one posting not one cost center one posting what he has done from all these will be posted yeah so here all these are the real depreciation areas so the system is um, show me an error so i fix those so the system is posting to, to all the areas into one gl by right it's technically not correct but um this is only a, a normal uh, um, scenario which is I'm showing you on how to run the depreciation area thank you guys